Hello everyone and welcome back to another Vanish tutorial here on the Blue Valley Gaming Channel. I just wanted to show you uh, real quickly how to build a library on Vanish. So we want to make sure that we are running the Red Ketchup Editor's Choice mod, which of course you can get uh, through the in-game mods. Uh, you, you don't need any special download for that. I'm going to load up a, a city that I've already already got going here and I'm going to show you just very basically how we're going to go about this. Uh, there's a special menu for uh, for the red ketchup mod. Uh, if you go down here to this community toolbar then red ketchup's logo. It's real easy to see. It's bright red. And then in here, uh, there's a number of different buildings, but in this in the corner buildings is where you're going to find, we've got stone, brick, and so on. I don't have brick in my town yet, so I'm going to look under stone. And then right here, you'll see this library logo. Okay, so we need to find a place to build this library. It will function uh, like like a school. So we already have a school here. So what I'm going to do is build this library across over here. I don't know for a fact uh, exactly what this is going to, you know, the rest of how the rest of my city is going to take shape. But we need them to bring 14 lumber, 24 stone, 4 iron, 8 glass, and 10 logs. So I will go ahead and uh, it looks like they're already bringing stuff, but are they already clearing stuff? But I'll go ahead and bump that priority. Uh, I believe they're making glass. So we should have glass on hand. We should have all these things on hand and I will show you once it's built um, it, it really operates the exact same way as a school so we won't have any extra work to do uh, we'll just hire someone to to work there uh, we should have enough builders that this should get done and we do have the stone there they go they're bringing the stone um, once it gets built, you just employ what is essentially a teacher. Now, I don't know how long it's going to take for us to get pupils or library patrons uh, in my particular city because um, oh, we have no logs. That's funny. The, the thing that I would have suspected would have been the easiest to get, we don't have any of those. So hopefully our our workers can can do that quickly. There they go. Chopping down a tree. See if they bring somebody's gonna come and get these logs and bring them over. I'm sure they always do this. They walk them to the th to storage, and then somebody else. There we go. He brought the last two, and uh, we'll have to wait. And another builder will probably come and finish it here in a second. I just figured, you know, it does. It's not a difficult thing to build. And I figured for the tutorial, I would just show you how to place it and then we can watch it get constructed. One of the things that I really love about the red ketchup mod is it's got these unique buildings, first of all. But also, I like that. Um, oh, wow. He came and did like two hammers. <laughs> uh, I like that you can enjoy the, the process of watching them be constructed as well it's it's a really neat mod see here we're, we're in this next stage of buildings you can kind of see the shell and then uh, I bet he'll stop short I'm gonna say he'll stop at like 95 oh ok 
Okay, here we go. So it's just as simple as this. Boom. We employ somebody there. But I did want to show you a little as close as I can get. This is as close as I can get. But you can see books outside. Got a little book logo there. Uh, I, I put it on the corner this way because we'll probably have a road continue going that way. But then uh, one of the really cool things, you can use the other two-story buildings. And because of how the roof line is designed here, if you put another two-story building right here, the roof line will connect. And then if you put another two-story building here, the roof line will connect. So I think it's really well done. And uh, hopefully you enjoyed the process as well. And I look, oh, our teacher just went there. Um, I look forward to your comments and questions down below. Otherwise, have a great time. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Have a great day, and I'll talk to you in the next video. Bye.